I'm on my own, broken and alone. I feel the rain crashing down. All around this empty town, I'm searching for the lost and found. But you don't care, you're unaware. Keep moving like the scars aren't even there. It's in the air, like a blazing flare. What's up guys, Nick Fox here. That little intro is from the other day. I actually went and biked to DC, it was about 60 miles with a bunch of people. Actually, this is probably the biggest group we've had so far. Uh, I've been doing it for about four years now. But anyways, uh, I met this dude and he was really good at coin magic and rubber band magic, just all that stuff. So he actually hit me up and asked if he could do a little tutorial on a rubber band vanishing effect. It's actually pretty cool. You have it looks like you have two rubber bands. You pull them together, and when you let go, it just disappears. So uh, I'm actually just gonna let him get into it. So yeah, I'll catch you guys in a bit. Cool. Hey guys, uh, I'm Connor. You can follow me on Instagram at at Connor I am. So basically, the effect is you can show two rubber bands like this. Okay, and watch. You just fling it back. And they vanish. It vanishes. You can do it in a few other different ways. You can do it just like this, and that's very visual. This vanish is for Crazy Man handcuffs. Two rubber bands, and you know the premise. They're behind each other, and then make one vanish. And while they're distracted, Put one rubber band in your wrist or on your pocket and do the move to get them like this. And then you just vanish one of the rubber bands. That's a super awesome way to end up your rubber band routine. So now that I showed you what it looks like, let me show you how to do it. Stick your hands out like this, put them towards each other, flip your hand without the rubber band 180. Put your fingers inside like this. So you see how they're going inside the rubber band now? Twist it, and then boom, stick your thumbs together. Now you got a super clean looking two rubber bands. If you wanted to, you can go like this to show up it like it's like they're two rubber bands. Cause then you just like, if you want to do that, I don't recommend it cause it looks like they're connected when you're doing like that. Let's like, you know, weird because no one like shows rubber bands going like that but th if you want to do that you stick your fingers out like that you boom put them together and you pull back from your thumb like that okay you can like ball it up and do it like that something like that this is a just do whatever you really want to do with this move it's a really versatile move now, let me show you the variation which is based off Crazy Man handcuffs. So, when you're at this angle, okay, you want to join them together, like if you're trying to do that, but join them together and you rotate it like this. So, you rotate your, um, let's say your right hand like this, so 90 degrees. And then you have it like that. It's, it's, it's clean. I don't know if I can get this angle, but it's clean from almost every angle. You can move it around a tiny bit to vanish it. After that, what you gotta do is it's gonna look like this. So you're gonna pinch down on these two rubber bands. You're gonna pull back. You can either do one at a time or all at once. 
if you want to get like the more like Instagram like really fast I think the all at once is a bit more like hyper visual let's like that but if you want to make it like a slow intense moment I think definitely going like like this and then releasing it that looks a lot more like cinematic I should say but anyways this is a really versatile move that you can use in a lot of routines but mostly cleaning up your crazy man handcuffs making them disappear so that is my tutorial let me get it back to Nicholas Fox all right well that was pretty cool uh, thanks again Connor uh, make sure to follow his Instagram at Connor I am pretty cool little effect here I mean you already know how it's done right take it at least you better if you watch this but take the rubber bands rotate it around that's gonna be a pretty good Instagram video, I think. I think I'm gonna do that today. But yeah, it's pretty cool. Uh, make sure to follow him on Instagram. Also, if you like this, if you want to see more of this stuff, make sure to drop a comment down below. Hit the like, subscribe, all that stuff. So yeah, uh, I'll catch you guys next time. See you guys. Invincible.